Good morning, Galaxy Heroes. I know that the event has ended, uh, but uh, this is the uh, the second part of the new challenge levels for Forest Moon. I'm not sure if we're getting... I saw a post somewhere saying that the Ground War one, which is Jedi, that's going to be semi-interesting. I mean, I've got a lot of our Relic 7 Jedi already. Uh, I've got my... Uh, yeah, I've got a lot of Jedi R7s, including gas now, so that shouldn't be, he says, famous last words, that shouldn't be too bad. This one, of course, was um, exceptionally difficult, and the comp, as you can see, I'm using is the one that I believe all credit goes to Skelterix. Oh, look, it's time to get up. Um, th yeah, I was just double-checking that it was still recording. Um, this was early morning, just uh, there was a couple of hours left of the event. Um, I'd struggled. I'd got to um, seven of eight with my Seppi droids, so GG lead, the the one that, that completed the first round. I managed to get to um, seven of eight before getting wiped out. Uh, at least that, I suppose, saved the humiliation of the final round, which is awful. But as covered, um, I watched Matt, actually, I commented on it as well, Mandy's Mandalore MW1, uh, more one, sorry, Ooh, change of name, uh, watched his vid where he does them, he did them both. Um, yeah, my preference, I, I did try and I, I'm probably not going to upload them now, but all the fails that I had um, with BB. Eight. That's what I tried first of all. Um, I either played it wrong or what I don't know. But uh, to be perfectly honest, Droidica. Um, my Droidica, I believe, is Relic Three. So everyone's Relic here. Um, and Thrawn's probably the lowest Relic actually. Uh, my B One is Relic Five. I believe B Two's Relic Three. Uh, Magna Guard's Relic 3, and Droidica, I believe, is either 2 or 3. But he does have the Zeta, so... Um, and, of course, yeah, he just... Yeah. That assist really does work for me, uh, which is probably the reason why I opted for the Droidica variation over the BB-8. But uh, apparently next time round we will see the BB-8 one. Um, and I'll probably try emulating that as well just to see if I can get that one to work. But, um, yeah, it's definitely difficult. Definitely difficult. Uh, as it should be. I mean, if, uh, originally pre-relic levels... Um, the the final challenge was a big challenge. I mean, you you know, just just numbers alone. You're going in with five tunes, and you're going against the probably the six best Ewoks. I mean, what missing is Tebow who, who had his day. I was a, I've always been a champion of of. Uh, Chirpa, love Chirpa. Going back to Chirpatine and even before that, I always thought Chirpa got a hard deal. And then uh, Ewoks got their rework and Chirpa suddenly became the Ewok, or the Ewok lead at least. Um, yeah, so here we go. This is the one. So this is, as we say, uh, well, not as we say, but you need to get past this stage. And um, I think the the real strat here is is to fracture Tebow. You know, I mean, I've I've bad mouthed him <laughs> all the way through this. However, uh, this one is absolutely ridiculous. There we go. So we got the fracture. Now we can get rid of the stealth. Um, Want to get rid of the revivalists, Ewok elders. So now it's just a case of uh, just spamming everything and just getting b1 to go as much as possible and also to keep magna guard alive those are the options and then just spamming everything for 
be one to go and whoop we're through that's probably until the last round the trickiest one although i must admit the turn meter generated by all these scouts in this level five of eight is uh yeah i think the the uh the grievous attempt that got to seven um lost two maybe in this round i think i lost mega i mean i with grievous i couldn't i couldn't survive the um the tebow round with all five tunes um and then this one are straight on the back of that and the ridiculous amount of turn meter that they generate just uh yeah, just just basically made sure that, that I didn't stand a chance. I think I did well enough to get to seven of eight. But, you know, uh, possibly a full R7 Separatist droid would do it. Hmm. Yeah, it's all going to be down to Tebow and just putting out as much damage as possible. All right. Okay, so we're through that round. We're still all intact. Um... This one, not so bad. Although these, um, whatever they are, hang on, I need to focus on one to, not the scouts. There we go. We shall call them not the scouts. Of course, I'm not going to see what their names are. But, I mean, they are, they really do. They did get a boost um, in this tier level. Because they, now, the warriors really do <laughs> some awful, awful damage. Um... Yeah, you, you've got to clear everything in front of you. Uh, personally, this, the strat is always going to be, for me anyway, is scouts, healers, as soon as they present to be able to get rid of... Um, I try to get rid of a couple of scouts just to take down the number of damages and the turn meter that they're going to give. Um, and then, yeah give and reduce as well don't they they take it away as well so here you go here's a prime example uh we've got three scouts ewok elder and the the warrior for some reason we're starting aimed at the warrior but i opt here to just put uh i'm trying to put a debuff i believe onto their elder but i do want their elder gone he's gone right now let's get rid of the scouts and we're relying on uh my b1 to um to heal everyone up but as you can see <laughs> with uh, the omission of of gg um my b1 is currently on 312 stacks which um yeah yeah quite pleased about that okay um I've just remembered the reason why we're just static there and apologies. Uh, the reason why there are some static moments within this is because, as you saw earlier, the alarm went off. Uh, I don't know about you. My beverage of choice first thing in the morning is coffee. And uh, I was in the middle of making myself a latte and a cortado. Yes. That is my beverage of choice <clears throat> as as I wake up um, and lazy on a Sunday. So um, again, we need we need uh, elder gone, but I also targeted and fractured low gray just to get rid of the days. And now we can really focus down onto elder, get rid of elder. I thought I was going to get an AOE, hence I didn't get rid of and I should have done. But now he's down. Now I want rid of Wicket if I can. Yes. Um, I think I'm going to switch. Do I switch over? And no. Oh, I, I did it a bit, but yeah, look, we're there. We're there. Uh, 330. 38 stacks, 341 stacks, 344 stacks, boom, take the screenshot, that will probably be the thumbnail, and Bob's your uncle, Sally's your aunt, thank you very much for watching.